All right, hello everyone. This is Robert Riesi from Riesi TV, and I'm here with an unboxing today. Now, this is something that I've been waiting for to come in the mail for a while now, and it has finally showed up. I think this is the first of a couple packages I'm getting from a place, but it's something I wanted to unbox because it's also something that's going to be relevant to my streams in the future. Let's get into what's into this box. All right. Christ, that's a lot of shit in there. All right. God, these boxes are bigger than I thought they were going to be. Holy shit, these boxes are big. So having me here are two, let's see, two copies of Shantae and the Seven Sirens Limited Edition from Limited Run. I bought two because I'm into the Shantae series a lot, and uh, I wanted to keep one sealed. So I bought this protective cover that's going to go on one of these boxes. And one's going to stay sealed. I'm going to open our one. Oh, it's one of the reasons why actually I bought two is so I could have one sealed, you know, keep it so later maybe, or just have a sealed copy. I have one where I could open it and not worry about, you know, cracking the package. And it also came with this little card right here. Seven Sirens collectible card. So we'll put the one that's going to say sealed in the back. Let's get this one open. This is a lot bigger box than I thought. It's probably about the width of four or five Switch games. I've... Or these are back in March, but due to the pandemic, I haven't been able to receive these. Let me get a little slice in there. There we go. So this has been on back has been on order from March. Let's get into the one I'm gonna open. This is a lot bigger than I thought it was gonna be. See what we got inside here. Little bag. All right, let's start with this first then. So here we have the Shante game sealed. So the Shante Seven Sirens and Limited, limited Run thing. And here is the steel bookcase for it as well. Anything in the inside? Not really. Steel books are always nice though, they're so much better than the plastic cases. Let's see if there's anything on the inside of the plastic case besides the cartridge. Alright. Let's see what we got here. Nothing special, we just got Seven Sirens, looks like a rule book? Oh, it's like a legitimate manual of stories about characters and shit. That's something you don't see anymore. I remember as a kid getting PS1 games, the first thing I'd do when the car would crack open to read the manual to look at like the story and shit. All that stuff used to be in those games. So while I have it out, let's transfer into the seal book for now. Put the little 
Insert up top. Cool. So I got that. Keep them like this for now. All right, let's see what else in this box. There's a lot more things than just that. We have the uh, soundtrack CD for the game. Got what, 35 tracks on it? It's pretty cool. Cardboard. Let me give me a second. Wait. A lot of the cardboard. Holy shit. Things are flying everywhere. Alright. The packaging is kind of nice. It has to, to hold all the stuff. Alright, let's see here. What the hell is this? This looks like a set of cards. I don't know what these cards are of. I don't even remember the cards coming with this. I'll just do this. They feel really. That's some interesting cardstock. So what are these anyway? These just. Oh, these are like. These are like little information cards about the enemies, it looks like. Completed for all the enemies in the game. Huh. I don't know what these references to the bottom are for, but I get two. Oh, okay. There's two separate cards. Hmm. So looks like it's a bunch of NPCs and enemies in the game. That's kind of cool. I was not expecting to see cards with this. I don't remember. I don't remember there being cards. What we have here, this is, I believe, the poster. All right, let's get this out. There are two sides to it. So we have this side, which is the first side. I'm assuming there's some new characters in it. I don't recognize some of those characters except for Shantae. What's on the back? Okay, here's a lot of the more classical characters of the game. It's a new poster. Alright, let's get that folded up for now. Aside. Where is it? Alright, so there's a stain here with a little object for it. And this is, I believe. Yeah, this is a dud Game Boy cartridge. There's nothing on the inside of it. And it has a stand for it. Get that put together. Let me get it over the knife clip then. It's just a little showpiece Game Boy cartridge. On here in the bottom. No, okay, just that's just the wood. There's like something on there for a moment. I can get this goddamn thing in here. Holy shit! You mean that? There you go. Okay, it's snapped in.
shit. Come on, get in there, you little bastard. Get those cartridge open. Yeah, the, the contacts are on our cardboard, so it's not an actual cartridge. But it is, it is a replica of a GBA cartridge for Shot to the Seven Sirens, though. How the fuck does it go on here? Maybe like that? Anyway, so here it goes. Okay, it, so the cartridge slides in on the thing, and it sits up like this. That's pretty cool. So got that, got the little standy thing. And that is everything in the Shantae Limited Edition box. So we got, you know, the steel book, the game, the soundtrack, the poster, the enemy cards, the um, standy, and then we, where the hell, I don't know where I put it, but the collector card that came over too, as well. Oh, there's other, collect, oh, there's more than one collector card? I don't remember seeing this one. I think an extra card fell out. Are there more cards in this? Because this, this was inside the game box, I didn't realize that. And we got the other one. Let me give it one check to make sure that I didn't miss anything. No, I don't think I did. Yeah, that's everything. That is a shot to the Seven, Seven Sirens limited run special edition that I purchased. And this game will be played on stream. I've been waiting forever to get this. Hope you enjoyed the unboxing. I hope you enjoy the game when I start playing it. I'll see all of you later.